gorgeous women in the entire world we're celebrating this beauty it's her 30th birthday well it's last week but we're celebrating today this is taylor and this is jordan and we are at patty ann's and yeah we're gonna eat and i'm not gonna vlog anymore maybe i'll do my food but that's it we're gonna chat and catch up bye good morning everybody um it is monday september 11th and I am currently editing the part one vlog. Hopefully I can get it posted today. It feels like so much work to do. Um, I truthfully am struggling today. I'm struggling mentally. I feel like I'm failing at fashion week. I feel like the comparison thing is starting to happen and like I hate feeling like this, but I want it to be all raw and candid and honest and <laughs> I told y'all I was gonna keep it real with you um, yeah I'm really struggling today I feel like I don't know I'm doing a lot of content on all of the socials and I never want to be that person that's like oh it's not doing well like I'm not doing numbers but the numbers are looking bleak and maybe I'm just like not approaching content in the right way and like if you guys are on my Instagram or my TikTok, if you have feedback for me, like, please give me some feedback. I would love to hear it. did like a, a literal 25 minute meditation this morning to try and calm myself. And that worked for about 40 minutes. And then I got back on social media and then now I'm like all riled up again. So I don't know what the purpose of this is, but I just wanted to tell you guys I'm struggling. <laughs> I know that you guys probably can relate to just feeling like we want to see stuff. Like, even if it's not like the most, like the highest of the highs, I just want to see some progress. And I feel like I'm regressing. I feel like I'm going backwards. And I feel like I don't know who my community is. I don't know who, like, yeah. All right, I'm going to get off of here because I'm so, I'm overwhelmed. I'm getting ready to head out and meet Ruby to go to a, like, showroom. And then I have an appointment after that to go preview a collection. My mood is so foul today. I don't know if it's the weather. I don't, I don't know what's going on, but I do not like the mood that I'm in, so... I feel like me going out, I'm going to try to shake some of this off. I should take some ashwagandha. I'm about to do that because the way my stress today is set up, I don't like it. Um, prayers up for me that it doesn't rain too bad. I'm literally in like four and a half inch heels and that with the rain is not a vibe, but we do what we have to do for fashion. Um, all right, guys, I should be leaving soon. Ruby should be getting there. In about 20 minutes and I'm still at home obviously so 
There's Ruby! Hi Hey guys, so I'm getting ready to go to my last presentation of the day. It started at seven, ends at nine. I think it's about to rain again. I hope I don't get caught in the rain because I left my umbrella in the Uber. <laughs> um, I just broke a nail putting my shoes back on, so love that for me. Gonna glue it back on because I don't have time to go get it done unless I go tomorrow morning, but I kinda don't wanna do that. Anywho, I just wanted to check in. We're going to Alina Liu, I believe is the name of the brand. I'll pop it up, of course, and show you guys sneak peeks, but I'll see you in a bit. Okay, guys, I don't think I stayed more than 10 minutes. I'm so tired. I just want to go home and finish the work that I have to do. Happy I got to see the collection, got to talk to the owner of the PR agency, and now I'm going home to kick my feet up and go to sleep. <laughs> Love you. See you tomorrow. Hi, friends. It is Tuesday. Is it Tuesday? It is Tuesday. I have had a pretty chill day. Um, I had some administrative things to take care of, some deadlines, and I also just needed a minute to rest. I slept in this morning, which was really nice. And I only have one event today that I'm getting ready to go to. It is the Sam Finger presentation. Um, I'm gonna bring, obviously bring you guys along. I am excited to see their stuff. Last season, they had some plus size models in the show. So I'm hoping that they do again. I would love to see some body diversity in the show, um, but we'll see. But I wanted to come say hi and let you know where we're going before we go. Uh, I realize I'm not as great with commentary sometimes. But... Obviously, I'm already in my PJs because that's how much I just don't want to be bothered. <laughs> I'm reaching the point where I don't want to do any of this anymore. And I know that sounds like such a bratty thing to say, but it is so frustrating when you go to these shows and even when they have plus size people in the show, you're overlooked. Photographers put their camera down when they see you. And I know I looked good. Good morning, loves. It is my last day of Fashion Week. Tomorrow is the official last day, but today's the last day that I have 
anything going on as far as I know. I'm getting ready for the Bruce Glenn show. If you're not familiar with Bruce Glenn, they're black designer twin brothers actually, and they use a lot of color. They typically have had size inclusive models in their show, at least they did last season. So I'm really excited to go. Um, I just took down my pin curls to let my hair just kind of chill out for a sec. I'm not sure what I'm gonna wear. So I got to figure that out and do my makeup. The show is at noon and it's on the west side of the city. So I probably will leave here by like 11.15. It's minutes to 10 now. So I have a bit of time before it's time for me to go. But I just wanted to check in and let you guys know what's going on, what the vibe is for today. After the Bruce Glenn show, I have one more show at 3 o'clock. It's called Wind Smoke Clears. That's happening at Spring Studios. I don't know that I'll have time to come back home and change before that show. So they're just going to get what I wear to Bruce Glenn. And I'm going to be super colorful for Bruce Glenn because that's what they are. Let me stop wasting time and go get ready.